This is the tape, the di new dining room set that I ordered from Bed Bath & Beyond. I'm getting rid of this one to replace it for this one. And these are the chairs. I thought the chairs was cute. That's why I ordered it. They're like supposed to be these leather, these leather uh, chairs. So I'm going to see how those chairs are looking in a minute. But this is the table. It is early, early in the morning, like seven o'clock. I just did an early grocery pickup as well as I'm about to go ahead and get my mama Roku stick from the kiosk box. <sighs> and it's cold. It's really cold. If y'all only saw what I had on, I'm like kind of embarrassed low key because I got these fuzzy socks on with my uh, Sammy Libby's on. I call them Sammy Libby's. My flats. But I'm about to go in Walmart and get this pickup from the kiosk box. So y'all, I'm back in the car. I got the Roku stick. And I'm about to go take it to my mama and see if she want me to try to hook it up for her. I say try because my kids will hook up all of my Rokus and stuff like that if not them Calvin so I'm gonna do that and then get back to the house because today is Saturday and that's the day I wash clothes and try to get my house together because I don't have anything planned today so I told Calvin I was gonna make it a point to be in the house today and not do anything he was like, yeah, right. I bet you by the time I get home, you're going to have something planned to do. And I'm really not. I was going to try to go to the candle sale, but I don't have time to be standing in a line for no candles. And with candles that I don't need and spend no extra money that I don't need. Since the last time I showed y'all my candles, I done got about probably five or six more um because when they had them for 14 dollars i bought at least five of them and then they had a buy one get one free pay 24 dollars get one free and i bought four of them that time so i know i got 20 candles all together i know i do so i don't need any candles i burn them but then i don't burn them every day and that often so, they're just sitting on my shelf collecting dust. Um, I actually gave some candles away to one of my cousins. So, um, if y'all saw me that day that I told y'all I had to drop some stuff off at my cousin at her job, during Halloween, that's what I dropped off. I gave her some candles because she saw one of my um, videos and she was like oh i love candles can you give me some candles and i gave her some candles so um and then i was like what kind you want she wanted my pretty one but i gave it to her gave it to her um it was a pretty pink one and she's a breast cancer survivor so I gave that, I gave her that one and I think a lavender one and a, uh, one of my lemon eucalyptus, mint lemon or something, um, ones that my friend Shanti told me about. Um, and I used those to burn in the bathroom. So I have like, I think two more left of those, but I gave her a total of three candles and some uh, Bath and Body Works plug-ins refills so anyway let me uh get to my mama's house and hello everybody i am back with a grocery haul these are the items that i got from my grocery pickup and i'm just going to show you right quick these are some items that we ran out of and things i needed to have for the kids for lunches next week and today is saturday
So I'm gonna start with this. I have two packs of hamburger meat, one that I'm gonna do uh, hot dogs and chili, and then I'm gonna do tacos with the other. Then I have these chicken breasts that I'm going to make uh, Chick-fil-A inspired, um, Chick-fil-A inspired chicken sandwiches. So that's gonna be a meal. Um, I meant to get waffle fries, but I forgot to add that on, but I did add seasoning fries. Um, so I guess that's what we're gonna have. I got some Chick-fil-A sauce the other day from IGA and y'all, it tastes just like Chick-fil-A. So if you see Chick-fil-A sauce in the store, especially the Polynesian, it tastes just like it. So I have this Fiesta blend for the tacos. I have some bacon because Callie's been asking for BLTs for lunch and yesterday was the last of the bacon. So I got some more bacon and some lettuce and some tomatoes for the BLTs for her. She loves her some BLTs. And she liked for me to put brown sugar on top of the bacon when I'm baking it in the oven. And then a little bit of cayenne pepper, just a little bit, and let them bake. And when I bake them, I put them on her sandwich with a little bit of Miracle Whip, lettuce, and some tomatoes. And she likes cheese on hers, and she says it's the best thing. So that's what we got the bacon. Next, I'm going to go into um, sausage. I got sausage for breakfasts, as well as I got some maple sausage for breakfast. have some hot dogs because um, I usually cook, make them lunch. So whatever lunch I make, Callie or CJ, I just make that for the day. So I'll probably do hot dogs Monday for our, um... <laughs> y'all, this is crazy. I just thought about it. I got hot dog, chili, the hot dogs, and didn't get hot dog buns. So I get hot dog buns if me and Calvin go to the store one day or I'll send Calvin to get some hot dog buns or whatever. Um, these are, this is for tacos. I already have a taco kit on the shelf and these are for breakfast burritos. What Calvin normally does is, um, cook the maple sausage and, um, takes this and put it in a frying pan and let it heat up a little bit. And once he lets it heat up a little bit, he'll add some scrambled eggs, sausage, the cheese, and wrap it um, like a burrito and let it cook on both sides and turn a little brown. And then they are so good because the, the cheese is melted in the inside. And he calls that his breakfast burrito. I got some bell pepper, red bell pepper, and some green bell peppers. Um, they didn't give me the best looking bell pepper today, but uh, that's what I have for smothered pork chops that I'll probably be cooking for Sunday dinner. Have some bananas, because I like, me and the kids, we both like bananas in our Cheerios. Um, yeah, these are my favorite candy my favorite i promise you these are so good if you see them try them and they say sour but they're more sweet than sour to me they're really good have some pancakes for breakfast some mornings i cook pancakes for them for breakfast and some mornings i just do toast sausage and eggs or bacon toast and eggs or whatever just to make sure they have a good breakfast i had a taste for some watermelon but calvin went to the fruit stand yesterday well he already knew but he went to the fruit stand yesterday and he was like they were all out of the yellow melons that i like they're really sweet um 
and he was like the man said watermelon aren't in season which we knew but uh he said i wouldn't advise you to get watermelon from nobody right now so i'm going to substitute this for my watermelon fix that i need and these are cj's favorite uh ham and cheddar hot pockets so he liked to have those for lunches and i got them a chip because if i make them a sandwich or they have a hot pocket they like chips with it for my drinks today yesterday i racked up i went to cvs i had a um i had about 21 dollars in cvs books so uh i used that yesterday and i got soft drink like what is, do they call it soft drinks soft drinks i guess sodas i got sodas and juices from cvs and i only had to pay like two dollars after everything um i also got toilet tissue that adds to my collection um because around here toilet tissue has been scarce in the stores um so i've been trying to keep up with getting toilet tissue to make sure we don't run out so i have some welch's juices and some power a's um and oh accent and my kids favorite their honey breast chicken tenders but accent we had to have some and i tried to make an order when i made my order with sam's just today that's supposed to be coming in a couple of days they were all out of accent so this completes everything that i got today on my grocery pickup now that i done showed y'all my grocery pickup let me tell y'all about this table okay so bed bath and beyond had a good sale on tables kitchen tables um this one was originally $500. It had, it's in Target for $500 right now. So I was like, oh, wow, that's a good deal. Because on Bed Bath & Beyond, I got it for $338. Why I feel like this table is so little, like I'm having buyer's remorse. So I'm thinking about calling them to see about my options for returning it. Because this was not what I wanted for this area. Like no i mean i knew that it was going to be a four seater but i thought the table was going to be bigger so i'm not happy with it so in that case i'm gonna see about returning it all right y'all so i'll catch y'all in a little bit because i need to put this groceries away as well as i have to get on cleaning uh what is that see see how they got my comma like I, this is a catch-all so i'm about to get on cleaning um cleaning uh my house i did the living room last night that's callie's ball she got for her slime ball and her books at she went to go stay the weekend with my sister so i'm gonna get on cleaning and i'll see y'all i know i told y'all i wasn't going anywhere today i really wasn't but my baby Said we're going on a date so we're here on a date oh so we're here on a date so yeah but i'm not going anywhere else after this i'm going home <laughs> this is my food and calvin has chicken quesadillas and i have ribeye steak salad and fries and some grilled onions and i have a drink and Calvin has a little market. Calvin go call them to see if they got oxtails. But why wouldn't you ask them if how much they are? That's not the question you asked. So we gonna drive twenty to thirty minutes to get oxtails no, and get there. No, we gonna we ain't gonna do that. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Come on, let's no, go. No, come on. Two hay with that. <laughs> what? Two hay with that. <laughs> what I mean? You know what I mean. <laughs> <laughs> no, I really don't. Yeah, what I mean? You know exactly what I mean. So, are we going to get the oxtails? Two hay with that. Calvin, stop playing. Are we going to get the oxtails? You know, I'll put you up, pick up the camera. Nah, I'll give you the camera something to look at. No, no, no. Gas station. So, they got a gas station right there. This is the place that Calvin comes. And I'm going to show y'all the meat. We came here to get oxtails. 
you know where everything got? Oh, they got wines. Oh, they got Stella Rose. Ooh. I'm excited. everything we got wine oh kevin i see cranberry canada dry what you doing, huh? we got a buggy a buggy a buggy oh them the drinks that mama them like Oh, they got a steak too. Yeah. Hamburger. I wonder how that smoked sausage tastes. Yep. See, they got everything, y'all. I need some beef bar broth. Oh, they got everything to make. It's not Katasha, if that's what you want, but you making butter beans, ain't it? No, I mean, I... I, I Did you, you get your tomorrow. smoked meat to go in your butter beans? I just... Yeah, yeah I'm CJ, be quiet, and I'm finna do a haul. <laughs> you being funny, ain't it? I'm sorry. So, y'all, our two chairs, extra chairs, finally came. These are how the chairs look. Calvin, if you don't get that old soda from up there, that ain't how you do no how. I know, she told me. Oh, that's cute. A dollar? You saw it. That was $13. No, I didn't. Oh, that's sweet, though. Calvin, you, you waiting to do your haul? I'm going to do my haul. Just let me, hey, let me, let me relax. How you going to relax and do the haul? Like, you, you say crazy stuff like that. No, I don't. Let me, let me get situated. <laughs> I don't say that I'm like that. Y'all, we got sweet potato fries. Calvin got some okras. We got oxtails that we're going to mix with um ribs tomorrow <laughs> have a uh, hall jaw giles for his uh butter beans but they didn't have ham hock so he got that got hot dog buns that we needed we got these two drinks because it's hard to find this sun kiss the peach and i love cranberry ginger ale and we got beef stock to put in the oxtails and the ribs, short beef ribs I have in the deep freezer already. Calvin got him a Pepsi. This is old. <laughs> Callie, do you want to show them what you got for your birthday? Yeah, From Adania. Well, yeah, you dropped some paper on the floor. She bought you a easy bake oven yeah, I got easy for her bake birthday. Oven. And it was so heavy, it ripped the back. But she, I think got some mixture to go with. Oh, that was sweet. She had given me three um, cake, pizza, and the last Ooh, one Oh, you get to make pizza. Cheese pizza. Okay, girl. Is cheese in here? Oh, no. We got white cheese in there. It don't necessarily have to be that. Yeah, how you going to have okay. cheese pizza with no cheese? And we got cookies. Cookies. Oh, that's sweet. Are you excited to make them? Yeah, I'm making Oh, goodness. Oh, All right. Well, I took a bite out of my French toast. But this is how dinner I cooked turned out. I ended up making breakfast. And, y'all, I tried it with this butter pecan syrup. That's so good. It came from IGA. But it's butter pecan syrup. And it is delicious. <laughs>
probably nasty. <laughs> probably. Tastes like those ones I got from Aldi. Aldi sparkle inside. Whoever told me they were good, no. Uh uh. Somebody said they were good. They are not. I want to try those. I always look at those when I come. What, Jones? The Jones sugar cane drink. It's probably good. It's the cream soda. Yeah. I used to love those cream sodas. The what? brown ones right here. Oh, yeah. Those IBC. IBC. Uh oh, sorry. Can you grab one? Kelvin tried to bit me. That's a red velvet cake. That a cake was a red velvet cake, but it was like red velvet icing on the top, no, but it wasn't velvet. a red velvet cake. It's a red velvet. The lady called me flavor. Had, she said it had real red velvet flavoring in it. Then what else makes it a red velvet cake if not the flavoring? Yeah. Man, there you go. She didn't know. She I had about. a bump, and I bust the bump one day and now I got this little thing on my face like it's annoying but yeah so ignore that please um but yeah so we Kevin bit me lost, baby. that he would drive he if lost. it's not a red velvet cake he she lost. said it's not a red velvet cake no I told Calvin you about I told you all the, the bit was if it was red velvet you drove mm -hmm. It's red velvet, but I'm still driving. But it's not red velvet, though. Baby. She said flavoring. Baby, I saw that. I saw that. I saw that. It was a shortbread cake, y'all, with little pieces of red velvet flavoring. It was no shortbread cake. It, it was, was not shortbread cake. It was a red velvet cake. What was on the What was on the label? Red velvet flavor. Yeah, hey, no, no red velvet flavor. You heard red velvet flavor. Clean flavor came velvet. out of that man's mouth. That lady. That was a lady. lady. That was a lady. Yeah, I see that dude. That was a lady. That dude worked at the All Team. No, it ain't. He changed my all the other. That was a lady. That was a lady. No, no, I don't. Anyway, y'all. You've been listening. We've been listening to two different people then. So we're thinking about taking the kids ice skating today, but Calvin's kind of like iffy about it. Which I think they're gonna be social distancing. My our town is always having like an event or something every week, like. They, they did the lighting of the tree and had a festival Friday. Um, Saturday through Sunday, they doing ice skating at the bean market. Um, so we, we took, I took Callie last year and she had a good time. So I think her and CJ would enjoy themselves together today. And they're, they're, I'm pretty sure they're social distancing and requiring you to wear a mask. Is that what they tell you? Yeah, and it's free. You. They tell you they're social distancing. Yeah. That's what they say. How they going to social distance in that little place? It's a big place. It's a place that I ain't had a wedding at. It's going to be a little place where you got no hundreds of kids coming it's out. It's not you know, hundreds. Like last last year, it was probably maybe about four kids on the ice. And Callie was in the corner trying to skate. We won't worry about it. Dude. No, we'll go. Or we could go to the Christmas lighting. No. I meant the um thing in Sumter. No, we're going. That's what I wanted to do. Uh, Remember, I said no, I wanted to go to the beach. Too late. We done commit to go. Remember, I said day. I wanted to go to the beach and look at the too lights. They got a park in Sumter. We are going. No, we're not. I ain't gonna go. You will see. This one, we could just drive through the thing and look at the lights. If you want to do that. If not, we could just stay home and watch movies. Bingo. So anyway, right now I'm going home because Kelly's been harassing me all week to make her a what is it, babe? You are irking me. Why don't you eat your breakfast and stop? Right. This is a chai tea latte. Mm -hmm. And it's good. And this is a this is a, 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 a chai tea latte. What? BLT. Couldn't remember. BLT. I'm gonna make her a BLT, and then for lunch today we're gonna to have loaded nachos. Calvin want to be different, so for breakfast 
he's doing corned beef hash and grits. Scrambled eggs. And scrambled and eggs cheese. and cheese. And um, for dinner, we're doing oxtails and ribs. He almost lost the eye trying to cook these oxtails in the pressure cooker. Hmm? You don't think so? You you ain't almost lost the eye? Oh. I couldn't tell the way that steam was coming up. And Calvin's doing his butter beans. And okra. And okra. So, I don't do the whole pot with okra because everybody don't like okra. The whole pot? You, you gonna put something on the side of the pot? No, that's not what I'm saying. What you saying? So you got to put the okra. You might as well do it on the, on there. Me and Kelly could just pick around ours if we get okra on our plate or something. Yeah, I mean, I, I like the flavor of okra. I just don't like the sliminess of the okra. Because, you know, I like, what what is it that I make with okra in it? Something I make with okra in it. Sakatash. You don't make that with okra. Sakatash. Oh, um, And I I'm like sorry. it in that. See? I'm sorry. <laughs> That's what we should have got to make uh, sakatash one day this week with some fried chicken. Okra, tomato, and corn. Yeah, okra, tomato, corn. Oh, tomato corn. Is that all I put in? That's it. Yeah. I don't know why sweet pea. I thought sweet pea. Y'all, I made some and our oldest came over one day and she was tasting it and feeding our grandbaby some of it. And yeah, she said she didn't want that. Either. She said she didn't want none, so she must have tasted the <laughs> sakatash that I cooked. She was like, ooh, what is that? That thing was good, y'all. With that fried chicken. Man, that thing was so good, I think I dropped my plate by accident. You caught it, boy, hit the floor, though. I know I didn't. Some of them went on the floor. Well, you ain't want to fix no more. You ain't that. You fixed me some more. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Uh -huh. You fixed me some more. Stop telling people to eat off the floor. I did not eat off the floor. Anyway, y'all. So, that's the end of this video, because I don't know how long it is. It's probably not that long, but we're just going to be in chill mode the rest of the day. Just enjoy this break. Work starts back tomorrow. And um, yeah, I'm excited about that. I'm excited to have a job, so let me stop. Yeah. Thankful and blessed to have Thank a job. You, blessed, yeah. So I'll see y'all on the next video. Bye. Say bye, Kevin. Bye, y'all. <laughs> it's so country. Bye, y'all. Uh, bye, y'all. Bye, y'all.